So we're going into Crucible 9 of the Pegwalk here today, where the modifier is bombs, red bombs deal 5 damage rather than 3. So I'm kind of scared. Uh, the red bombs can quite often screw me, but uh, anyways, it's not too big of a deal. I think we'll be able to get through this. And for those wondering what the Peglock is, the rules should be up on the screen. I'm trying it like this this time of rather than explaining it, I am just going to be uh, listing the rules followed by the orbs right about now. <laughs> um, so if, and for further details, they will be down there or for just reiterations of them, it will also be in the description below. But yeah, we, we're back to doing uh, the peg lock. I've got a feeling that today it's going to be pretty reasonable. Um, I have an idea of what I want to go with. Um, and it will be fairly uh, relic depending, dependent, depending on if I find it or not. Kinda, I'm kind of okay with taking this. I... I really did like it last time I took it uh, the other day, so you know what? Maybe I'll like it again today. Bomb ceiling plus 10 damage, I do think fits into what I want to go with here. And you might be able to tell. Uh, let's do heal 6 when reloading. I do quite like that. Um, plenty of relics is really nice to start off here. Um, but I think what I want to be really aiming for today, and I want to use up this boss for like before it becomes too big of a, too big of a downside to take it, and I probably should have actually taken it last time around, and that is the Sapper Sack. The Sapper Sack is one of those ones where I'd love to I'd love it if it worked, but I don't have faith that it will. So I kind of want to take some orbs that are decent, but not uh, commit to anything in particular. So that's where we're, what we're looking at today. Now, if you could please go down to the elite fight, give me a decent relic and fight. That would be ideal. The fight actually not bad with uh, my double bomb relic here. It should be good. Um, it would have been better if I had hit both of those bombs, but uh, here we are. <laughs> that happened. I, I actually have no idea how it just did that like little loop-de-loop. -loop. It's kind of really unfortunate, but um, honestly not too big of a deal. Um, I will be able to get two of them ag again. Um which is kind of really unfortunate on how it's happened, but uh, you know what, not a big deal. Concentrication actually doing wild damage. And, wait, am I, oh no, I do take a little bit of damage. Honestly, not that big of a deal. Uh, I should be more or less full health. That's a really strong elite fight uh, to come out of here. Uh, I will upgrade this, and you know what? Taking the Lucky Penny is always quite nice. Always having that, there's a lot of synergies with that in the future, so... Oh, heck yeah! Getting another identical fight to the one I just took out. Uh, it's gotta, it's gotta be, um, it's gotta be good, right? Uh, okay. I did save the bombs one extra turn this time. Hopefully that doesn't... Hopefully it helps me, maybe? I don't know. It... If I hit one more, no! At least I... At least I'm not wasting any, so there's something at least. Oh, nice! I actually managed to hit two there, too. Not even just one. Love to see it. Oh, if that had crit, no! If that had crit, it would have done so much damage, but no, alas. It was like, nah, not today. Uh, I actually am probably going to be taking more damage than I did last time, which is really unfortunate, but uh, what can you do, right? Unless... Okay, no, I, I definitely will. Huge shot. This concentration actually does a lot of damage if you can bounce it off things. Wow. Um, now, 
I could go bombs, although I think I'm probably already going to have enough on the board. I think refreshive might be a little bit better. Consistent refreshes all the time is honestly one of the best relics, in my in my opinion. Refreshive, constantly refreshing the board. And then it just synergizes with refillabuster. <laughs> I should have gone to that fight. Whoops. I didn't I did not realize I was skipping something here. Not too big of a deal. I should be fine. What is with these slime fights though? It's just giving me the same slime fight over and over. I feel like some of these runs have to be seeded with how often I get the same uh how often I get the same um elite fights on every floor. It's it's got to be the case. Okay. Um actually think this might be the play. A hundred? Is that enough? I don't know if that was a super good concentrication. I did see a 175 last time. That would have been nice to get here, but honestly not too big of a deal. Okay. Ooh, that was huge. That little pop of the bomb actually saved that shot completely. Um, and then this should just be game over. Very nice. Didn't even take damage that time. And I don't think I can upgrade anything. I cannot. Um, do I want... What do I want here? I could try and get some kind of a refresh build going on here with the uh, Ballant. I already have some... Or, sorry, a uh, reload build. I'm gonna... I'm kind of tempted to try that. I am kind of tempted to try that. I do I do think that the peg bag was actually a better uh, option to get two refreshes is really nice. Um, but I don't know. I, I did kind of really want to try out the... Uh, I, I did kind of want to try and get one of these refresh builds on. It, this might not be the time to do it, if I'm going to be honest, because, you know... Peglock, I don't want to lose any more, more orbs than I have to, or relics if I do find them. Duplicate an orb, I will duplicate the concentration, even though uh, I am going for a reload build. I need some kind of a backbone of orbs, so that should do the trick. Especially if that hits two bombs, sadly not. Um, okay. Oh, that's, that's very nice. That's actually so nice. And what's even better is that because it was separate, the two concentrations were separated there, I could skip the, uh, I could just skip it and then shoot another one of it. Or I could wait, shoot the stone, get the damage off, and then get the targeted damage. Had to do that. And there we go. Oh, is that enough? It is with the refresh. Nice. It might have even been without, but, uh, yeah, whatever. Uh, nothing here I'm after. The Glorious Suffering could be cool, but, uh, I think I'm gonna try and save that one for a later time, because that is a very strong one. I was kinda hoping to find the Sapper Sack for this floor, but... Because I didn't, I don't know, maybe the three extra bombs will be enough, plus... Uh, it's, it's gonna be tough. That's for sure, it's gonna be tough. Um... Three extra bombs, each doing ten more. I, I'm not sure. We'll have to see how it goes in the end, but... Uh, the goal is that it's going to be more or less good. I mean, that's that's always the goal. <laughs> so, can't really, uh, can't really judge that one. Oh, no! The bomb actually walked in front of it. Ah, uh, it doesn't... I guess it didn't matter in the end, but uh, that, that works for me. Um, gonna save my gold again. By the way, I cannot upgrade. Um, the reason I am not upgrading... That wasn't my fault. I swear, that wasn't my fault. Um, but the reason I'm not upgrading... Um, the reason I'm not upgrading the... Ah, uh, what am I thinking here? Uh, basic orbs is that... If I didn't put it in the rule set, or I didn't clarify, the basic orbs I can have, it's just that I am not able to upgrade them, so. Uh, and I, cause, just because I mainly don't want to rely on them, and I think that's a good strat, uh, a good middle ground to avoid, um, 
to avoid having to go custom builds all the time. Nice, another concentration. That's huge. Now, do I upgrade it twice, yay or nay? I think the answer is nay. It's just a normal fight coming up. It could be an elite fight, but I have my doubts. I have my doubts. I didn't feel it in my bones, as it were. <laughs> um, let's see. Oh, shoot, I was hoping I... I, I need to aim for the bombs here, or I'm just going to take so much chip damage, and I don't have any healing or mitigation at the moment, so really need to make sure I get that. It does require five bombs to take them out. That's so unfortunate. Or, yeah, five bombs. Yeah, that makes sense. Um, I should be able to get it here, though, with the concentration. Even... And then I'll even get a little bit of a heal. Um, I'm not gonna spend too much time uh, just trying to lob everything down into the pit here just for the sake of healing off of my well done steak, although that is something I probably should be doing. I, I'm pretty sure you guys don't want to see that, and it is pretty cheap, so I, I don't think I want to do that. But if it happens naturally, it happens naturally. I wish it does, does I. I, I hope it doesn't, I should be saying. Because this is not fun. I, it, there, there's no threat here. It's just chilling. That's it. Uh, just need to do... Perf... Oh, of course you survive with nine. Okay, whatever. Whatever, whatever. Um, Might as well heal as well. I have the gold for it. Okay, there goes one third of my heal that I just spent 25 on. Jeez. Um, hmm. Again, I don't want to rely on stones, and I feel like getting Suffer the Sling, although it's not necessarily a relic, it kind of fits into that category. Special Button is really nice. Complex Claw is really nice. And then I think removing an orb might actually be better than the Strange Brew. That one was close, because I do have a lot of crits on the board. But, um, I do have the feeling that, um, it will be a little bit better to just have, uh, one less stone here to get through. For both reload synergies and also, um... For both reload synergies and just general um, thinning of the deck purposes. Half to, half to thin the deck, most of the time. In almost every scenario I've had, thinning the deck is better. Sometimes not, but most of them are. Okay, let's see here. Gotta hit maybe one more bomb and it looks like I'll be able to kill. Or not. Okay. Oh, of course, all three of my concentrations are down at the bottom. Why wouldn't they be? Why wouldn't they just do that to me so that I end up taking just a little bit of damage? Of course, why not? Yikes. It was such a good shot, too. Ah, whatever. I'll get over it. I forgot to upgrade that thing. I completely forgot to upgrade that thing. Cannot believe it. I... Thank you. <laughs> I was gonna be not so pleased with myself. I jumped the gun on that shot. I was like, oh, I can't miss. I could have missed. I, I could have missed. I'm happy I didn't, though. Okay, um... Here we go. Hit the crit, and then... Just need to aim for bombs at the moment. I think that's the play. Just hit bombs. It's easy. And then, uh, do I want to aim for that one? I feel like I probably don't, but I'm going to anyway. Oh, I could have killed the back one! I should have done that. I, I'm actually going to aim for the one that has more than two bombs worth health. Even though it, I'll probably take a little bit of extra damage because of it? Um, it might still be worth it. Oh, shoot. Oh, yeah, uh, that was not worth it. It was not worth it at all. Whatever, I'll get over it. 
Of course, that one does like 400 damage shot. <sighs> It's, it's always the it's always my last shot that's always the strongest hopefully i can find some kind of healing in the infernal ingot or uh something like that unicorn horn is pretty nice given the fact that i am relying on the concentrications at the moment uh uh no i'll, I'll continue passing on this way it would just bring me to a normal fight which i am not interested in at the moment Yikes, that was a bad shot. That was a really bad shot. That was also a really bad shot. Stop doing this game. Stop stop making me have really bad shots, please. Please. Um Okay though. I might end up dying to this, honestly. And I just I, I know I saw one of these comments the other day, like, oh, a psychological psychology based on uh the fact that i am even though i the run is failed i am discarding this we're like oh it, you'll probably just not post runs but of course i'm going to of course i'm going to it's the peg lock and i do want to share especially if it's like decent runs like this is a very decent run um, even if we fail here hopefully i don't know i might be jumping the gun a little bit there's still a lot of shots I've got left. I am gonna do a double hop, hopefully. Oh yes, that was such a good shot. But yeah, uh, even if it's like a decent run that does fail, of course I'm gonna show it. It might screw me later on because I'll end up without some of my orbs, but I, I don't know. I feel like it's, um, it's still re worth it to do that. And I will heal here. Rod of Frost would be really nice. Although, ah, I think the Rod of Frost is nice. Yeah, I know the concentrations, which I'm mainly using, are targeted. But having the Rod of Frost for the ones where I can't should be very nice. I think I'm gonna die. I have two shots to kill this thing. Like... I am not super... If this was the wall, sure. I could see me doing the wall. I don't see my myself surviving this thing. Maybe there's a world. Maybe there's a world. I could be very wrong, um, but I just don't have healing. My damage isn't quite that good. I probably should have picked up another orb, but I just wasn't fully thinking. Oh, of course, I missed that. Oh, come on, please. No! I'm not confident here. I am not confident whatsoever. Uh, maybe, though. Maybe it's fine. Oh, that was such a good shot. If I had more health, it was fine! No! I think if I had managed to survive one shot, one more shot there, I would have been fine. But sadly, not quite. But I, I do hope you guys did enjoy. And that is one more orb crossed off the list that's really unfortunate i was really hoping this would be the day uh anyways see ya